Now, there is information pouring in that B Y Vijendra, who is uh, the son of B S Yadurappa, has been appointed as the Karnataka BJP president. Now, joining me on the telecast is uh, Jay Prakash from Bengaluru. Jay Prakash, big development, even as B S Yadurappa has taken a back seat when it comes to active politics in Karnataka. His son now has been made the BJP Nash, BJP Karnataka president. This news pours in even as there was a statement that was made by uh, H.D. Kumaraswamy of the JDS claiming that there were as many as 30 plus of the MLAs from the Congress in Karnataka who were already in talks with the BJP and he spoke about how BJP that was in fact H.G. Kumaraswamy and his political party JDS were aligning with the BJP for the 2024 Lok Sabha elections. He exuded confidence in the, uh, in the alliance to defeat Congress in Karnataka for the Lok Sabha polls. Jayaprakash on the telecast with me, Jayaprakash, uh, details with regards to this big development, uh, B.S. Yadurappa's son being put at the helm of affairs for the BJP. Well, absolutely. After a huge uh, poll uh, debacle for the BJP in Karnataka, the BJP couldn't retain uh, Karnataka uh, from 120 seats. Uh, they came down to uh, 59 seats. Uh, in fact, uh, there was a lot of political churning. We've seen how the BJP has taken a very long time uh, to appoint a new state president just eight months ahead of the Lok Sabha elections, very important elections, uh, with about 26 seats held by BJP out of 28 parliamentary seats. So just about two have gone, one each to JDS and Congress, and 25 with them with one independent, Sumalata from Mandya, supporting BJP. This being the case, uh, they had to decide a uh, lot of uh, groundwork is supposed to happen with Congress at the LMF Affairs. We've seen how Congress has been moving very quickly, uh, holding meetings after meetings on uh, deciding the candidates for the local elections. Of course, uh, uh, the big news coming today that the party has finally decided on Vijayendra. Vijayendra, he is the next gen of the BSY family. Uh, in fact, B.S. Yadurappa quit active politics last year uh, after about uh, 50 years uh, uh, in Jansang and BJP. Uh, he announced that big announcement uh, just a month before uh, the elections to the SMD. Uh, then came the big announcement of Vijayendra getting tickets uh, from uh, the very Shikari for a constituency, which was held seven times for the USA Durappa. Yeah. So the legacy clearly goes on uh, to the next gen. Uh, Vijayendra, of course, uh, uh, is uh, uh, the legal heir of uh, BSA Durappa, I can say, political legal heir, you could say, uh, as now he takes on the big responsibility of the state presidency. He was vice president for the last uh, three and a half years uh, after BSA Durappa, uh, in fact, uh, made way for Bombay to become the chief minister. Uh, this was around uh, 2020 uh, and uh, from then on he's been waiting in the wings. Uh, he, is, uh, he is quite capable, he's charming, uh, he's educated, he's got uh, the, uh, all the capabilities of uh, pulling the masters. He's quite popular with the youths too and finally B.S. Yudhira Pasan getting that big ticket. For more such videos, subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel, hit the bell icon.